Welcome to Indian Laboratories Forum. Now we are learning about Clause 7.7 .7 of ISO IEC 17025, 2017. General Requirements for the Competence of Testing and Calibration Laboratories. Hope you have learned up to Clause 7.6. If not, please refer our previous videos. Clause 7.9 Complaints The laboratory shall have a documented process to receive, evaluate, and make decisions on complaints. This particular clause is demanding the procedure for process of receiving evaluating and making the decisions on complaints. A description of the handling process for complaints shall be available to any interested party on request. The laboratory should provide the complaint handling process to interested parties, such as customers, regulatory bodies, accreditation bodies, etc., based on request. Upon receipt of a complaint, the laboratory shall confirm whether the complaint relates to laboratory activities that it is responsible for and, if so, shall deal with it. Once the complaint is received, the laboratory has to verify the complaint details and confirm whether they are related to laboratory activities. If it is related to laboratory activity, the lab has to deal with it, perform the investigation, and take appropriate actions based on the investigation outcomes. The laboratory shall be responsible for all decisions at all levels of the handling process for complaints. The process for handling complaints shall include at least the following elements and methods. Description of the process for receiving, validating, investigating the complaint, and deciding what actions are to be taken in response to it. The complaint handling procedure should detail the process for receiving, validating, or confirming complaints, performing investigations, and deciding on actions to initiate and implement to resolve and avoid the recurrence of similar complaints. Tracking and recording complaints, including actions undertaken to resolve them. Ensuring that any appropriate action is taken. The laboratory receiving the complaint shall be responsible for gathering and verifying all necessary information to validate the complaint. Whenever possible, the laboratory shall acknowledge receipt of the complaint and provide the complainant with progress reports and the outcome. Always acknowledging the receipt of complaint is best practice and providing updates on outcome of investigation, corrective action taken. Wherever possible, the laboratory can follow this practice. The outcomes to be communicated to the complainant shall be made by, or reviewed and approved by, individuals not involved in the original laboratory activities in question. The laboratory has to perform the investigation on the complaint received and the investigation should be done by the person who is not involved original laboratory activities in question. Independent person should perform, review, and approve the investigation outcomes. Whenever possible, the laboratory shall give formal notice of the end of the complaint handling to the complainant. Takeaway from Clause 7.9 the laboratory should have procedure on process for handling complaints. The complaint handling process should be made available to concerned personnel, based upon request. The complaint should be recorded, tracked, and the investigation performed, and appropriate actions should be taken. The outcome of the complaint investigation should be communicated to the complainant. Complaint investigation should be done by an independent person who is not involved in the activity in question. Examples of non-conformances as per Clause 7.9
laboratory is not having documented process for handling of complaints. A complaint investigation is performed by and approved by the same person who is involved in the activity of question. The laboratory has not registered the complaint received from the customer X on January 15, 2024, and no documentary evidence of action taken is available. Hope you enjoyed learning about the requirement of Clause 7.9 of ISO IEC 17025 2017 and examples of nonconformances as per Clause 7.9. Please like, subscribe, and click on bell icon for regular updates. Thank you. Happy learning!